in this video we will learn about area of polygons rather area of inscribed polygons we will learn it using a problem from isi entrance 2013 this is problem number 15 objective here is the given data there is a circle whose equation is given as x square plus y square minus 6x plus 5 equal to 0. This is a circle. There is a 12 gone, a regular 12 gone, regular means all sides, any angles are equal, a regular 12 gone, 12 sided polygon. It's inscribed in the circle. The 12 gone is inscribed in the circle. Our goal find the area of the 12 gone. Okay. So, what we really need is at the radius of this circle. We need to know how big this circle is. And then we can do the area computation without even worrying about the other information about this circle. So let's do that. Let's find the radius of this circle. It's quite simple actually. We will be converting it into the regular form. So x square minus, let's write negative 6x as 2 times 3 times x plus let's make 3 square and let's subtract 3 square because we don't have that we also have y square and 5 so let's add y square and let's add 5 it's equal to 0 so we did not really change anything about the circle uh, circles equation we introduced a 3 square we subtracted a 3 square okay so th this turns out to be x minus 3 whole square plus y square equals to 4. So we can write 4 as 2 square, right? So what type of circle is this? If you know the a little bit of coordinate geometry related to circles, you will know that this circle has center at 3 comma 0 and a radius of 2 units. We don't need the position of the circle really. We need the radius of it. That you will see soon the radius happens to be exactly two units okay all right so what we really want is the area of a 12 gone that is inscribed in a radius 2 circle now let's see how we can find that out so we have a circle with radius 2 And there is a 12 gone like this. So I'm not drawing the entire polygon. I'm drawing some sides of it. There will be 12 sides like this. And we want to find out the area of this 12 gone. It's quite simple actually. What you have to do is just to f you have to find the area of one of these 12 pieces. And then multiply that by 12. If you can find out the area of one of these triangles and multiply that by 12, then you'll be done. So we will be using a little bit of trigonometry here. The angle at this center, this is 360 degree by 12 because this entire angle is divided into 12 pieces. So it's 360 degree by 12, that's 30 degree. So the two sides is 2 and 2 of this particular triangle because both of them are red eye and the included angle is 30 degree so we can now find the area of this triangle area of this triangle oab using the sign rule of area of triangles that is half times oa times ob times sine of the angle in between okay so you know the length of oa you know, know the length of OB, you know the length of sine of 30 degree. So now can you find out the area of this 
entire polygon, the 12 sided polygon. It's just one line. You have to multiply the area of this triangle by 12. This is the area of one triangle, multiply it by 12 and give the final answer in the comment. Keep on doing great mathematics. I will be seeing you in the next video.